Join me weekly for Experience Galveston for ideas of what to see and do on beautiful Galveston Island. Today on Experience Galveston, we're meeting with Catherine Stroud and Elizabeth Punches to learn more about their newly completed mural right here at the Galveston Island Railroad Museum. We are here at the Galveston Railroad Museum visiting with Elizabeth and Catherine about this new exciting mural here. Wow! <laughs> Well, I mean, this day and age, everyone wants to get that Instagram photo and, you know, mm -hmm. those murals are really going up all over Galveston. So this is such a nice addition here at the mm -hmm. River Museum. Tell us a little bit about the history behind it and how long it's taken you to do the project and all the details. All right. Well, this is actually a mural restoration. The original was done in October of 89 by Jan Spencer and... It, the main similarity between hers and ours is the train being in its location and there's still that wall that is a faux wall for this mural over here. So we added all the juicy colorful flowers, all the greenage, the sign over here of course for our Instagram Facebookers. I guess that's more Instagram, huh, with a hashtag? But um, yeah, and speaking of that, we've had, uh, before this was even halfway done, we had so many people come and stop and take their picture with the train. While we were painting, people uh -huh. would stop us and we'd put, ask for paint brushes and we'd pose with them and, and it was great. The feedback's been wonderful, the interaction's been fantastic. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, like Catherine said, the original composition is very similar to what we have now, but we wanted to bring it the color-wise so that it comes off of the wall. Mm -hmm. Well, and how long does it take to plan ah, something like this? The planning is the most important part. Uh huh. And so the weather. The sure. weather gave us about four months to plan. We planned, we wanted to start in January, but with the cold and the rain that just kept coming, we were only able to start four days ago. Four days ago. So this is our last day. We're From finishing it all up. Um, so it took it. So it took several months to plan, and then how many days? About four days. Four days. Four days. Mm -hmm. Oh wow! When well, you know what you're doing, we. And <laughs> honestly, it was one good day of planning. Yeah. But we had to just talk about it because we weren't able to paint it yet. So right. we, you know, fine tune little things here and there. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then you submitted it to um, the director. David. Uh, Dave. Yes, David Robertson's a director here, and so he hired us, and then we made the plan. Yep. And he approved it and and there it is. All of the colors are important to the train reading as if it's coming towards you. It really does look and like the it's The saturation popping is right important, uh, the laying in is important, and it, that took a little bit of fine tuning to get that right. Well, and then tell me about, are these oleanders or what kind yes. of? Yes, so that is, uh, <laughs> <laughs> yes, a nice hedge of oleander. <laughs> and I just can't help myself, I love painting impressionist style and laying them in like it is a very happy spring for those oleanders which of course is the flower of Galveston right yes it is and so are these blue bonnets here on the bottom they are and David the manager just recently had a bunch of blue blue bonnets planted in front of the museum so upon his uh, request we now have blue bonnets in the field people don't realize unless they back up that 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 shape right there is actually that wall building. to that building if as an illusion mm -hmm. but when you're back up over there you can get the whole both of the murals in the same shot you can see it mm -hmm. wow that looks pretty amazing well congratulations on completing this project thank and, you and uh, where can people see more of your art oh elizabeth Elizabeth Punch's studio and gallery, um, 410 23rd Street. We have the most recent uh, work from Catherine Stroud, as well as my own. It is a functional studio as well as a gallery, um, so you'll see stuff in progress as well as new fresh work every week. Mm -hmm. well, and we do host a live auction that's of right. our small little studies, as we call them, and that's every art walk, yep. which is about every six weeks and they mm -hmm. are fun everybody gets a paddle yep and uh it's a good time it's a great evening well thanks so much for sharing this new piece and um, i'm sure everyone who comes out to the railroad museum is going to enjoy seeing it i hope so 
Thank you for joining me for Experience Galveston. Remember to submit your ideas to I-45 Now and Galveston Now and find us on Facebook, Instagram, and on YouTube.